B is B T group. B and T. B and T group. You need the and. B and T group. Yeah. Tell me about the B and T group. What makes you guys unique? What trends you're seeing in the show um, or in the industry? Okay. No, anything on the horizon you'd like to share? You want me to add that one for you guys? No, it's too speculative. Okay. Don't you know, I mean. Yeah, it's going to wrap back to small cell and bass and outdoor and stuff. I, we'll get into it. Yeah, well, I'll answer trends, it. When I ask you the yeah. trends question, I think you can lead in gently. It evolves into that question yeah. anyway. Ruder? Ruder. Okay. Yeah. And first I'm going to... Oh, I'm sorry, yeah. Oh, you're in Chicago. I'm in Chicago, yeah. The company's based in Tulsa. Y'all see you at the head note for him then, right? I'll be there, yeah. That's going to be a good one. Yeah. I'm excited about that. All right, we have David Reuter, R-E-U-T-E-R, -E -E Executive Vice President, B&T Group. Hi, this Hi. is Lindsay Franklin with RCR Wireless News. I'm here with Dave Reuter with B&T Group. Thanks for joining me. Yeah, thanks for having me. Tell me a little bit more about B&T Group. Okay. B&T Group's an engineering and construction company based out of Tulsa, about 180 employees. Uh, our customers are you know, the likes of Verizon, T-Mobile, Sprint, AT&T, the tower companies as well. Uh, we service them with engineering, uh, construction, site acquisition. Uh, we're getting in the DAS and small cell as well. What makes unique, your company unique? Well, we're able to self-perform uh, most, if not all, of our services. We can do turnkey uh, with our customers. I think there is a very strong need for full turnkey services, and we can uh, perform all that in-house. Great. And what trends are you seeing at the show or in the industry? Yeah, hot buttons are small cell yeah. and DAS for sure, uh, especially this year. Last year it was uh, peaking, uh, d the interest was there, the build-outs weren't happening yet. We're seeing the build-outs now from the carrier's perspective, the money's being spent. And so there's a lot of activity at this particular show talking about how do we get in front of it, how do we support the carriers? What challenges do we have? It's, it's been pretty interesting. Exciting times. Oh, for sure. <laughs> well, thanks for your time and have a good show. Okay, thank you.